Oh, yeah, gonna listen to some music right now. Got some rap going, gonna get it going on now, huh? This is Hip Far and I'm Ryan, and this is the product spotlight. Gonna listen to music on the Onyx right now, so hold tight. Hey, everybody, and welcome back to the product spotlight today. We are gonna be checking out some new Bluetooth speakers which just arrived in our distribution warehouse. Recently, we struck a deal with a brand called Phonic uh, to bring Canadian consumers their entire line of quality Bluetooth. Starting with the smallest, the Solo, this is the Phonic Solo, customers will enjoy the portability and sound in their personal space. And I really like the quality, feel, and weight of the Phonic Solo. Uh, the Solo features IPX6 water resistance rating. Um, an extremely interesting feature though, is that it has a built-in FM radio mode. So you can access that. So you turn your power on. Bluetooth mode and you push the little M button on the back here. FM mode. Guaranteed. And it changes it over to sleep FM mode. Country, Press now. the plus button to scan to the next station. But then if I want to go back to Bluetooth, just push the M button. Bluetooth mode. On the back. Um, I think that it's a nice addition for anyone who doesn't really want to fight over playlists with friends. Also, the, uh, the little hand loop here, the little finger loop, uh, it does, you know, pop out so that you can strap this around. Just hang this up really anywhere that you want to be. 12 hours of playback, it's awesome. You know, you set it up, hang it up, not think about it, and just listen to your music through those long study sessions or, you know, whatever else you got going on. Five watt amp, perfect for personal use. This solo speaker isn't going to blow people away with its sound quality, but it's fun for kids and those looking to add a bit of music to their personal environment. Uh, but don't take it from me. Uh, we did some testing with all of the speakers. So here is the testing we did with the solo. Get this thing started up here. Push the button in the middle. Awesome. Bluetooth mode. Okay, so my phone is full blast. Let's start turning this up here. Yeah, that sounds pretty good. It's got like a little bit of um, a little bit of bass to it. Hang that thing up. Just listen to some of your favorite tunes. Damn. All right. Like sitting like that, you get a little bit of like desk vibration that maybe comes into play. But if you had this thing hung up somewhere, it's not gonna sound too bad. And did I forget to mention that you can also pair two Phonic Solo speakers together? Uh, it's a great chance to get your customers a shareable product ready to gift wrap for the holiday season. Hopping over to the Duo. Speaking of pairing two speakers together, uh, if your customers are looking for a great two for one deal, the Phonics Duo Bluetooth speaker gives you the best of both worlds. Uh, you get a great sounding, respectably loud speaker that fits in most car cup holders. The look and color and sound uh, and simple functionality of the Phonics Duo makes this one of the most superb gift ideas for that difficult person to shop for. 1500 milliamp hours in each of the speakers with up to 14 hours of playback and it offers TWS technology for wireless stereo sound. TWS stands for true wireless stereo. So you do get true stereo sound. Uh, to get the full experience of both Phonics Bluetooth units, simply press both of the power buttons simultaneously. Pressing the power buttons, uh, the Phonics Duo will show up in your Bluetooth list simply as Duo, with the Solo and the Apollo also just showing up as Solo and Apollo. Super simple. Now, as far as sound profile goes, going up to the Duo, let's hear the sound coming out of this bad boy here. Like that. It's definitely a little bit louder. Let's push this thing up through its paces. I like it. It's a little bit louder. There's some richer sound coming out of it. The bass popping off of them. directional sound that comes out of them. I, they sound pretty good. You can get them right up close here. Yeah. I like the 
sound of that. Ooh. Yeah, they're just bouncing around there. The 48 millimeter drivers and dual 10 watt amplifiers offer more than enough loud sound for a night of board games with friends or you know a picnic at the beach. And look at I mean look at those uh, look at those two subwoofers there as well. You know offers pretty solid sound. The Phonics Duo is a great speaker to take on the road. It fits in most cup holders, like I said before, and you'll never have to worry about splashing with water or you know even accidental submersion with IPX7 waterproofing. The stylish modern looks premium materials, loads of power, and a small frame make this an easy to carry, dashable in your purse, Bluetooth speaker. Duo will definitely be a hit. Another thing that I really like about this too is the silicon wrap that goes around it that holds everything together. Uh, also acts like a nice little stand. It holds everything up nicely. You've got the little, you get those little feet right down here. Both of them have their, you know, up and down buttons so you can control them autonomously or you can control them together. Super easy to take apart, super easy to put back together. That is the Phonics Duo. So moving on from that and moving aside the solo, we got the big boy here, the Phonics Apollo. When you really want to bring the party, the Phonics Apollo has more than enough power to keep your friends dancing and happy well into the wee hours of the morning. I, I, I remember the old boom boxes, you know, with the CD player and, you know, you bring one over to a buddy's house because he didn't have a very good stereo system. Well, this is a nice compact way to do that exact same thing that we used to do as kids. A carrying strap, which turns this into a bit of a fashion statement as well. It's easy to take with you anywhere. You know, if you're skateboarding and you're trying to get to the skate park and you want to bring some loud sound with you, you're going to a barbecue, anything. It's it's going to look sharp too. And it also comes with crisp audio. Crank that volume up. And that's how you know it's at full volume. When you hear that sound, that's full volume. Okay. So now we'll just turn it up on the phone. Yeah, I like that. I like the sound of that a lot. And that's not even a full blast. Like that's uh, not even, that's not even 50%. It's not even 50% on my volume here. And that sounds fantastic. It's like really bassy compared to the other two. This I would say is the most bassy, and this gets the most loud. Like, if I had this thing at actually full blast, uh, like, let's turn this down just a little. If I had this thing actually at full blast right now, um, it'd be blowing my microphones out. You wouldn't be able to hear me speak. Uh, we've tested it in the office like this. You can hear this thing from the warehouse to the marketing department. It's really nice and loud. And yeah, I mean, you can carry this thing around and get sound anywhere. You can carry the party with you anywhere you want to go. Really with any of these, you go, you, you know, you, you get what you pay for. Like you go from the smallest up to the biggest, there's going to be a change in sound for sure. I would say the smallest one's good for uh, personal space sound. Uh, the next one up here, the duo is going to be good for, you know, sharing with a few friends, you know, out at a picnic. Uh, maybe you stick this thing in your cup holder and you use it uh, while you're riding driving around town um, And this bad boy here. This is gonna take the party with you anywhere you want to go It can also connect from a lot of different sources too. Uh, you know listen directly from USB playback on a flash drive via Bluetooth uh, or even from the 3.5 millimeter jack, if you've still got a phone that uh, connects that way. It also has IPX6 waterproofing, so you can get splashes and you know, it can get a little bit wet and that's fine. So, you know, like we had talked about earlier uh, with that uh, acronym TWS, uh, it, this, the Apollo does have TWS connectivity, which allows you to pair two Apollo speakers together and gives you stereo sound. The 60 watt amp that's built into here and the bassy woofers that are included on both sides here give this great rich sound uh, which is enough to drown out any of those annoying neighbors and it definitely will set the tone for that upcoming party with 12 hours of playback so you know final thoughts on the 
phonics line from the solo duo and the apollo um i really enjoyed testing these speakers out and you really do get something different with each of them uh, if i had a big critique of the solo though um it would be that you know the sound was a little bit crackly in like the higher treble sounds when you got you know kind of almost maxing this thing out and you know, it has micro USB for charging, which I'm like, you know, this has USB-C, this has USB-C. Why couldn't you put USB-C into this one as well? Like, come on, Phonics, like, let's let's get with the times here. Let's get rid of the micro USB. We don't need it anymore. But uh, other than that, Solo does give you a, a light compact design with unique features and having that FM stereo built in is kind of nice. I like that. Uh, the Duo, you know, that's your twist apart. That gives you the two for one and it is the only one in the lineup that has IPX7 rating. Um, and then you've got the Apollo, which is the boom box format that brings that big stereo sound when you need it. They do get louder as you go through the lineup. And depending on your customer's needs, you know, there's, there's something really for everyone in the Phonics lineup. Uh, from fun and compact, uh, big stereo sound, Phonics has quality sound in an easy to use product. Um, you know what else is easy to use? The thumbs up button. So make sure that you leave one of those. Also drop a comment down below, subscribe if you haven't already. Um, it would mean a ton to us, but you know, I'm Ryan on behalf of HitFar. Thanks for watching. We're done shining a spotlight for now, but we'll see you next time.